So we, all right. So we just made it to the rim shop here. It's called Speedway. Um, Family-owned business. And I like dealing with people like that because, uh, as I was looking for my rims, man, you got some people out here that be trying to sell you what they got in stock and they ain't worth a damn. And you know, you know how it go. So you gotta remember when you go to these places, some people will try to stick you if you let them. You know, I always had this ability. Most kids have them when they're born. The first word they say is no. Um, so that's what you got to do. So I'm going to check you guys out in a few. And uh, I'm going to show you the process uh, when you're going to look for your, your aftermarket rims. All of them. So once again, we back. So I'm at Speedway. Nice shop. Um, like I said, mom and pop. Real good people. Uh, talk to you nice. Treat you good. Um, but, yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw some aftermarket rims on. See how my baby look like after this here. Try to give it a little bit more um, aggressive look, you know. So, yeah. So this is what she look like now. I ain't gonna lie to you, she clean as hell though. When I'm gonna pop it out, I'm gonna stand out type of guy, so I want my truck to stand out just like my personality. So, so this is the rim I'm getting right here, like fuel, 22 by 10. They look nice, right? Look nice. But well, they got everything that you need here, man. They got everything that you need here, so. They do security systems, radios, music. They do it all. I was thinking about getting chrome, but I used to have chrome rims, and there's a lot of cleaning that you got to do, man. It's like an all-day process. So they got the truck up. They got the truck up, putting it together. This is nice. See the lugs. They also have this thing called snap that they do. You see it on this door called uh, get up to 3,000 uh, cash, no credit check. You can do your financing or whatever, but uh, I ain't doing that. I walk through the door, I'm gonna give them this right here. That's right, well, that's what we gonna give them. Hey, that's what it's about. Out the door, don't gotta mess with your credit, don't gotta run nothing. I'm just gonna get it, so that's how we get it. All right, all right, look who we got. They putting them boys on. They putting them on. They look good, got a little poke out too. That's what's up. All right. Got all four on now. Got all four of them on. After that, gotta get my alignment done. You remember, you take the factory off, you gotta get that alignment done. Don't let them get you guys like that. Right, her happy to throw some rims on and not get an alignment. But that boy starting to look nice. Look nice. Hey, look 
Nice. Now they about to do the alignment. Knock that out. Two things. Does it ride good? Yep. Do it look good? There she go. There she go. Ooh, she look nice. I just got my rims and everything put on, driving back home. One thing I love about it is that there's no rub, no strub. So, um, but yeah, um, that's the best thing you need for your vehicle. You know, you put the rims on. Some people put rims on that's real big and some gonna be rubbing. You know, or they have to cut. I don't want no cutting. I don't want no rubbing. So I went a 22 by 10 so that I can still turn, full turn, uh, without any, any uh, anything rubbing. So I don't made it home. Now, pull this thing up in the yard. Now she sit good now. Look real good. Yeah, so Speedway on Colonial. They give you a fair price. Good people to work to uh, do get some work done for you. Um, Also, too, perfect size 22 by 10. Got space in between. I can turn without no rub. Turn without any rub. Yeah, so that's it. That is it. I also got some light, um, some um, rock lights coming that I'm gonna have put up under here. Get them rock light put up under here so they can, um, so when I'm ride at nighttime, I can turn them on. Then I'm also gonna get the lights that go around the um, rim caliber. And I want to have that UFO look. Comment, let me know what y'all think. And then this here is my baby. It's my Firebird Trans Am. So 2000 just got it to 82,000 miles um, long tube headers cat back all the way uh, straight pipe all the way back uh, have a stage 2 cam uh, tune right now I'm running a good high 11s in the quarter you guys this uh this cold start
what though? If you want some, come get some. I'll give you that gap sauce all day. I don't care what you drive. Come with the Hellcat if you want to. My car light as hell, and I'll run you. No supercharger on there, but I'm about to get one though. I'm gonna get one. But y'all, thank you for tuning in to another Pear Tree Vlog, and I'll catch you guys later.